Hello there folks, welcome back to our channel, your one-stop destination for all things cryptocurrency. If you're new here make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on the latest in the crypto space. Today, we'll be diving headfirst into a monumental event that's currently shaking up the world of cryptocurrency, the historic token burn of the CRO coin. We'll also be going over some major upgrades that are set to redefine decentralization as we know it. So, fasten your seatbelts folks, we're about to embark on a thrilling journey into the future of crypto. Let's get started. What if I told you that the future of crypto is on the cusp of a major shift towards full decentralization? As we speak, the gears of change are grinding, ready to propel the crypto world into a new era. A future where transactions are faster, costs are lower, and control is fully in the hands of the people. This isn't just a pipe dream, it's a reality that's fast approaching. The CRO chain mainnet launch is right around the corner, signaling a significant step towards this goal. Its full decentralization is a bold move, a game changer that will redefine the rules of the game. But what does this mean for you and me? It means a world where payments, DeFi, and NFTs are all driven by a fully decentralized open source public chain. This is not just an upgrade, it's a revolution set to redefine the world of crypto. So you've heard about the 70 billion CRO burn, but what does token burn actually mean? Let's dive right into it. Imagine you have a pie and that pie represents the total supply of a certain cryptocurrency, say, CRO. Now each slice of that pie represents a token. When we talk about a token burn, we're essentially talking about removing some of those slices from the pie, never to be eaten, or in this case, used again. Token burn is a strategy used in the world of cryptocurrency to permanently remove tokens from circulation. This is done by sending the tokens to an address from which they cannot be retrieved, effectively burning them up, hence the term token burn. But why burn tokens? Well, the principle is rather straightforward. By reducing the total supply of tokens, the value of the remaining tokens can potentially increase, assuming demand remains the same. It's basic economics. When supply decreases and demand stays the same, prices tend to rise. Token burns are also a way for projects to control inflation and instill confidence in the market. It shows that the project developers are committed to maintaining a stable value for the token which can attract investors and stimulate growth. In essence, a token burn is a strategic move to boost the value of a cryptocurrency. It's like making the pie smaller, so each remaining slice is worth that much more. Next, we'll dive into the specifics of the historic 70 billion CRO burn. Now let's dive into the details of the largest token burn in history. Picture this, 70 billion CRO, Crypto.com quote S native token, set to be incinerated in one monumental token burn. But what does this mean exactly? Well, let's break it down. The token burn is scheduled in two parts. The lion's share, 59.6 billion CRO, was burned immediately. Just like that, a significant portion of the token supply was wiped off the map, never to return. This immediate burn represents a bold and decisive move towards decentralization, a significant step in the evolution of the crypto ecosystem. But the burn doesn't stop there. An additional 10.4 billion CRO has been locked in a smart contract, set to be burned on a monthly basis as they are unlocked. This gradual burn ensures a steady progression towards the ultimate goal of full decentralization. Now you might be wondering, what does this all mean for the circulating supply of CRO? Well, prior to this burn, the circulating supply was sitting at around 24%. Post-burn, however, we're looking at a jump to over 80%. That's more than triple the initial circulating supply. This increase in circulating supply is expected to provide a boost to the token's liquidity. More tokens in circulation means more potential for transactions, more opportunities for use, and an overall healthier, more vibrant ecosystem. But let's not forget the significance of this event. This is the largest token burn in history, a move that is as audacious as it is unprecedented. It marks a major milestone in the journey towards a fully decentralized open source public chain with high speed and low fees. It's a statement, a declaration that the world is ready for a new era of payments, DeFi, and NFTs. This massive burn marks an unprecedented move in the history of cryptocurrency. But what does this mean for the average crypto enthusiast? Well, let's dive into that. The CRO burn has implications that reach far beyond just the number of tokens in circulation. It signifies a shift towards full decentralization, a move that aligns with the ethos of many within the crypto community. Firstly, the burn will help secure the chain network. 
5 billion CRO will be allocated to mainnet block rewards for chain validators and delegators. This incentivizes participation in the network security, creating an infrastructure that is not only decentralized but also robust and secure. Secondly, the burn will stimulate chain ecosystem development. 900 million CRO will be allocated to Particle B for this purpose. By investing in the development of its own ecosystem, the chain network is fostering growth and innovation within its platform. This will not only attract developers and users, but also contribute to the overall health and sustainability of the chain ecosystem. But perhaps the most significant implication of this burn is the journey towards full decentralization. By increasing the circulating supply of CRO to over 80% and burning a substantial portion of the tokens, the network is shifting the power from a centralized entity to the hands of individual token holders. In a nutshell, this token burn is set to make CRO 100% decentralized, sparking a new era in the world of payments, DeFi and NFTs. So, what have we learned today? We delved into the fascinating world of token burns, understanding how they work and their impact on the crypto market. We then zoomed in on the largest token burn in history, orchestrated by none other than CRO coin. 70 billion CRO tokens are set to be burned, with 59.6 billion gone as of February 22, 2021, and the remaining 10.4 billion locked in a smart contract, set to be burned monthly, as they unlock. This monumental burn will increase the circulating supply of CRO from a mere 24% to a whopping 80%. The remaining CRO supply will be allocated towards mainnet block rewards and chain ecosystem development. 100% circulating supply, 100% decentralized, 100% ready to reshape the worlds of payments, DeFi, and NFTs. As we stand on the precipice of this new era, remember this, crypto is not just a currency, it's a revolution. Wow, what a journey it's been today, folks. We've navigated the complex world of token burns, explored the implications of the CRO burn, and peeked into the future of crypto and decentralization. If you enjoyed this video or found it informative, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. Your support means the world to us. We always love to hear from you, so please leave a comment below with your thoughts or any questions you might have. It's your engagement that makes this community so special. And now, a sneak peek into our next video, the rise of NFTs beyond digital art. Trust us, you won't want to miss it. So stay tuned and keep exploring the world of crypto with us. Thanks for watching and see you next time.